Hi, in this session, I'm going to cover the GoSeek feature. The GoSeek feature is one of those what if analysis tools that you can use in Excel to help you determine what changes in a value need to be adjusted in an input to get a certain desired result. So let's use an example of a home loan. We have a home loan here. We want for $200,000, a loan amount for 30 years at 3%. And with that, we have a calculation here. This is a Excel function, the PMT, that determines the monthly payment plus interest, principal and interest, that you need to pay if you were to take out a loan uh, amount at 30 years at 3%. And this, this calculation determines that. Now let's say that we are, can only afford $600 per month. Now if we only could afford $600 per month, we have to change one of these inputs here. Now let's say we will change this input and say, well, maybe I'm not going to take out $200,000. Maybe I'll take out less. So we'd have to go here and try to figure out what we can take out to get to that 600 value. So 180, 180,000 does not get us there. Let's try 170,000. Control enter. That doesn't take us there. And we have to iterate through this a couple times to get to our 600 figure. Now with the Goal Seek feature, this does it instantaneously almost. So you don't have to go through and iterate a couple times. To get to the Goal Seek feature, we need to go to the Data tab in the ribbon and go under the Data Tools go to the what if analysis icon here and click the click it to drop down and go to goal seek it will open up a goal seek dialog box or a window and there's another way to also get to this I like keyboard shortcut so the other way to get to this let me cancel out of that is to press alt T G that will bring up the same window and in this windows in this window there are three fields that you need to enter the first is the set cell and this is the cell that's going to contain the formula that you want to change to your desired result so right now it's at 716 we want our monthly payment to be six hundred dollars per month what cell do we want to change to get to that monthly payment at six hundred dollars per month we want to change the loan amount we want it to determine that so the set cell here has to be a formula uh, that gets referenced by the other cells. The changing cell needs to be a value. It can't be a formula. So we're going to change this cell to a certain loan amount to get to our 600, to our 600 here. Let me click OK and it's going to ask you if you want to keep these values and I'll just say OK for now and you see that we have our 600 value. We only could pay for $600 per month. What kind of loan how amount do we need? Well, that's the maximum loan amount, about 142313 and change. Now, something to also keep a note of is, let me go ahead and bring back the dialog box, the GoSee dialog box. This changing cell value here, that has to be, oops, let me cancel that. That needs to be, that formula needs to reference one of these inputs or it needs to reference the input that you're changing so if I press F2 to go into edit mode you'll see that the loan amount is referenced in that form so just something to keep aware of when you are performing the go seek function so I hope this helps thanks for watching